Hey guys, so I'm gonna go on holiday soon to Scotland, Edinburgh with my sister. It's gonna be for four days in total from Sunday till Wednesday. And I thought it would be fun to share with you how I pack my suitcase. So let's get started. So first things I like to do when I start packing is go on the website of the company that I'm flying with. Uh, this time it's KLM, the um, uh, Dutch Royal Airplane Company or whatever. Um, and I made a little list of how much I can bring, how big the suitcase and any, everything can be. And I like to write down, um, for example, the weather. I can bring a total of 12 kilograms. This can be divided over two items. One can be a suitcase or like a big handbag. Uh, I have the sizes written down and then one is a personal item. This can be a small handbag um, or a little uh, backpack. This one actually matches the right size. Um, so yeah, besides that, uh, I look at the weather, so it's gonna be cold. <laughs> it's good to know when you wanna bring the right clothing, like I'm gonna bring some sweaters. Then I check how many days it is, four days of which one day is when I arrive. So I already have the clothes for that. So I need to pack for three days, really. I usually pack for like seven days anyway, so that's <laughs> ridiculous. But anyway, that makes me feel comfortable. Then I like to bring a little um, bag as well. Um, this is just to put my wallet, my passport, uh, and like always, some nice mint. Um, and here's another mint, uh, peppermint, yum. Um, so I like to bring this because when you wanna um, go into a restaurant, like just go for dinner or just pop into a store or something, you don't want to bring like a full backpack so I like to bring just a little bag with me and I can just easily pop this in my suitcase um, or in my actual handbag so that I can just pull it out so I have that then like mentioned before have my wallet and my passport always good to bring or else you can't leave the country um, and I just have a book that I'm reading now that I'm gonna bring on the plane so that the time will go a little bit faster. Um, so that's pretty much the things that I want to throw in the personal item as well as this reusable bag. Always handy to have one of these with you. Sometimes I know in the Netherlands it's not allowed for stores to give free plastic bags anymore so Instead of paying for loads of plastic and it just being bad for the world and whatever, I like to just have these and you can just roll up the bag and put it in here and then pull it out again. So I reuse this 10 million times. So yeah, that's gonna go in my personal item. So let's focus on the actual little suitcase that I'm bringing. So for this trip, I'm gonna be using this easy suitcase it's nice and pink and it has four wheels to take it around everywhere really easily one compartment is with the strings and one is with the zipper to keep both of them separate from each other uh, i always like to pack with package cubes so that's what i'm gonna be doing as well today uh, first i always like to have some t-shirts with me so i decided to bring three different t-shirts one just a bit cuter one uh, with stars a simple v-neck t-shirt and a striped black t-shirt they're all with uh, short sleeves because that's what I like to wear then for under sweaters I have two simple tops one in dark blue and one in black uh, just to keep warm I have a little package cube which I'm gonna put those in. So this already is pretty much for like a whole week. <laughs> uh, if you could include the sweaters as well. So there we go, that is one package done. Then because it's gonna be cold, like mentioned before, I have some sweaters or one sweater and a couple of other warm things. 
have this flannel uh, piece that I really like uh, and it's pretty warm with a top under it um, and then a coat over it of course. Then I have this coral salmon color uh, sweater which has happy on it and it's not too thick but it still keeps you nice and warm. Then I have this um, just a jacket to throw over everything like over those t-shirts to keep me warm with a little hoodie. And then last but not least I have um, a high-waisted black pair of jeans. Um, I am gonna wear jeans of course when I'm gonna take the airplane so I already have that so I have one extra pair of jeans for when the other one might get dirty or something on the bus tour um, so put this in and as you can see the sweater is um, like the jacket is pretty thick so I might actually just wear that to the airplane so let's decide on that now I'm just gonna pull this on when we go on the airplane that way my package cube stays nice and flat <laughs> So, just close that up. And we put that in there. Then, um, for pajamas, of course, I like to bring um, a jersey and uh, just some jogging bottoms, which are also nice to put on when we get back to the hotel room. Um, because they're nice and comfy and I got the jersey in Japan when I lived there from like the soccer team that was pretty nice so I can pretty much put that on this side uh, as well um, or if that is too tight I can always switch it over to the other pocket uh, which I might actually do so that I can put some other stuff in there and then of course there's underwear and socks. I like to bring extra pair of socks because you might end up one day when it's like raining a lot and you don't want to end up with like wet socks and then don't have any extra ones. Uh, so yeah, that's the main bit packed. Then I like to bring a laundry bag as always. Like to put all the laundry in, of course. Then a pair of fluffy socks that are nice and comfy to wear on in like the hotel room when you get back from a long day walking around as well as these like flip-flop things so those can all go in this one pack or one side and I will close that over now There we go. So that's that all packed. Um, don't have to touch that anymore. As you can see, there's still quite some space left there, which is always really nice. Then there's always the famous bag of liquids. I like to throw like everything uh, that they use, like in the bathroom and stuff. So I have some um, cleaning stuff, like the cleansing milk, cleansing tonic, toothpaste have some deodorant, body butter, shower gel. I know you get this at the hotel, but I like to bring like my own like favorites. And I like to always bring a pack of blister bandages for when I'm out walking or something. So that's pretty much it. I uh, still have quite some room left, as you can see over there. And I'm um, just gonna leave that open for now. I also have some makeup that I'm bringing. I usually don't have a lot of makeup, but um, I am not putting it in now yet because I am still using this for the next few days. Have a mascara, have just a BB stick is what it's called. It's like the really light color just to um, get rid of like some spots or like cover them up. Just a simple lip liner as you can see and then there is 
the super oversized eyeliner that I like. So I'm just gonna bring those as well and still gotta pop them in those bags, uh, like the liquid bag. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much it for now. So there is a lot of space left. Um, and I might actually throw um, a pair of shoes in there um, if I want to bring another pair. But I think I will just leave it like that because that way I have some space for um, goodies that I buy. Well, that's pretty much it for the packing video. Got my suitcase all sorted. And lastly, I also like to bring uh, just a folder to put like my um, plane tickets in. And for this trip, I need like vouchers for the bus, uh, vouchers for a transfer. So I just put it in there so it stays nice and doesn't rip up or anything. So yeah, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, maybe it helped you on like preparing for your own packing. Uh, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed already, you can subscribe, and that way you will get a. Uh, notification whenever I pop up a video and I'm also gonna do a vlog of my adventures in Edinburgh and Scotland so if you wanna see that stay tuned and it will pop up on this channel so I'll see you next time bye